Welcome to this video where we'll be creating a bar chart in Excel using Office 365. Similar to other videos, the easiest way to create any chart in Excel is to highlight the data first. Highlighting the data by pressing on the first cell, A1, dragging till you select all your data. Now, in Excel, there's a difference between a bar graph that we use in statistics and column graph. In statistics, we use bar graph and we call it horizontal bar graph or vertical bar graph. In Excel, the bar graph is called column graph and for the horizontal bar graph, it's called bar graph. So similar to other videos, to insert the chart, we go to the insert tab and the ribbon and we look for the charts group over here we have the bar or column chart so if you click on the arrow you will see that we have what excel called column gra graph and what they call bar graph so we're going to choose the two-dimensional bar graph and you can see that it's what we call the horizontal bar graph similar to other charts you can change any of the properties by selecting the chart first. Make sure you're selecting the chart, your map and the uh, cheat itself. Then you select the chart and you can go to add chart element and you'll see all the options that you can add. You can add the axis, you can add title with more options as we saw in other videos. It shows you the option here. You can add table, we're going to look at this later on, labels, and so on. And similar to what we did in other videos, the other option would be to add or to have access to these elements from the plus sign over here. You can check or uncheck the option that you want. And if you click on the little arrow at the right, it will give you the other options more options give you what we had a minute ago. So let's go and make sure that we have the axis title and you can see that we have both the primary vertical and the primary horizontal axis title. So we're going to go to the axis title and click on it, highlight it to delete everything and here we're going to type number of students. The same idea for the vertical one. We're going to type letter grade. Let's select the title and this time we're going to right click instead of going to the element and we're going to say format the chart title. I'm just going to add some colors here. Let's choose light color. I'm going to change the borderline. And you can change type if you want a flat if you want to make it with a shadow or you can change the alignment inside the text the text box another thing we're going to do is just to add couple of options just to show you different things. You can change the grid line. As you can see, it's showing only the primary major vertical grid line. Let's add the horizontal grid line, which allows you to have better view. You can add the minor one, which is going to add different values. We're going to just stick with that. Let me show you the data label where you can add the data label 
on the table and this is useful if you move the chart to another place. You can add it with the legend or without the legend. So here you can see the actual label. Let's add the data value here. And if you add the data label, you don't need this table over here. Okay, now let's take this chart and move it to the new sheet as we did with other videos. And let's call it And as you can see, this would be helpful if you don't want to look at the table itself, you want to display the bar graph, you have the labels over here. Let's change some of these colors. So if you click on the chart, the bars, you're going to select all the bars, click one more time on one of the bars, and only that bar is selected. And we can change the color, we can format the data label for that particular chart and to whatever we want with it. So let's change the color, select the other one, and let's do the same. This time let's choose different color, different color. And this way you can just pick and choose the colors that you want. Thank you for watching and look for the other videos on different charts in Excel.